person, I don't care how much money I have in my account, Klarna or Afterpay me, please. Hey everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tia and I'm back with another video. In today's video, we'll be getting into all the tea about my Tupperware bags. So let's go ahead and get started with the video. First, we're going to start with the ordering of the bags. So Telfar did have a bag security program um, last year around October. So I purchased my bags October 9th of 2021. I purchased a small navy bag, which was $150. I also purchased a medium azalea bag, and that was $202. So I have a medium and a small. These are my first two bags that I've ever purchased from Telfar. So I was really excited. I can't really tell y'all the reason why I picked the colors. It was honestly just like random, to be honest. So yeah, bags and the taxes included. Total came out to $378.40. There was no shipping included with my purchase, so the shipping was free. And then I also, <laughs> let me put y'all on game. I also used Klarna to pay for my bag. So the way that Klarna works is it's four payments. They take an initial payment the first week, um, like the day of your purchase, and then they'll take another payment two weeks after you had made your initial payment. And then they'll basically do it like two weeks after each payment until you reach the four payments that you owe. So I actually like doing the Klarna option because you're not going to receive your bags right away. And that is a lot of money to just be deducted off of your account and you're not gonna receive the product right then and there. So the best option for me is to do Klarna. I'm the type of person, I don't care how much money I have in my account, Klarna or after pay me please. That's just how I am. So yeah, so when you're making a big purchase like this, especially with the bag security program, it just kind of makes more sense to use Klarna or Afterpay. Well, I believe he only takes Klarna, but don't be running off on y'all payments. Like, make your payments, for real. <laughs> so I ordered those bags October 9th. I received my first email that my bags were on the way March 14th of 2022. So I'm like, okay, like I'm finally about to get my bag. I will say with me receiving my tracking number on the 14th it only took three days for my bags to be delivered but you always want to make sure with you getting these bags delivered at a later date that it's an address that you can guarantee that you'll be able to get your bags from so the best option for me with these bags was to get the bags sent to my mom's house because that's a guaranteed address you know you might be moving switching apartments whatever whatever the case may be you might not be home whatever could happen so you always want to make sure that you have a guaranteed address that you can send these bags to because these bags are expensive and you don't want to just have your bag laying around at an address that you're no longer at just to make sure you can get your bags so i did receive a delivered email on the 17th of march um from so far so it did only take about three days for me to actually receive my bags so now we'll go ahead and get into the unboxing of the video so y'all excuse me let lay through away my box but it doesn't matter because it's a plain brown box which is if you watch my um, Marc Jacobs tote unboxing, it's basically the same brown box, which I like that because the, you don't have to worry about um, people trying to like take your box or know what's in your box. It's very discreet. I like discreet shipping just so people won't be all in your business. Um, especially if you're not home when your package is delivered, you always wanna make sure that, you know, nobody touch your package. So, yes. But, Lele did throw in my box. So I don't have a box, but I do have the bag. So, we'll start with the azalea bag first so i do like the fact that it comes not only with a duster but it comes in a plastic bag as well that way any liquids or anything won't get on your bag so i do say that they do securely ship your bags off to you um you don't have to worry about any stains or anything like that and also the brown box it didn't come damaged or anything like that it just came like a regular brown box i know sometimes they be throwing your boxes around and stuff but no i didn't experience that all right and once you get your bag i can't remember if these came like this they probably did but yeah so this is the duster bag which i think is really cute you know especially with luxury brands you always supposed to get a duster bag with your bag um so this is just a good way to store your bag if you're not using it i really like that and i like the fact that he has his um logo on the front of the bag as well this is my medium azalea and it is so pretty. I can't wait to wear it. Like you could, y'all know me. I throw anything on like black or whatever. But no, this is really cute. And this will really be pretty with black. 
um, like a whole black outfit. I think it could be really cute. So on the actual bag, it does say Tell Far, established 2005, New York City. I like the fact that he does promote his brand and put his brand on everything. You know, it's just very cute. It's just the details for me. Also on the bag, it has the type of bag that you got in the color as well. Also get a receipt with your purchase as well. It has my address on it, so I blinked it out. But they check off what type of bag you have and the color and everything, as well as the price. So I like that. It's so pretty and it's so vibrant. I really, really like this color. I was kind of scared that it would be super bright, but honestly, it's really pretty. This comes with a little button that you can close your pocketbook with. So this is the inside. It has the Telfar logo on the inside. You also have the tag that comes with the purse. So I like that as well. Very pretty. And I've also been told that you can pop these off and just in case you want to resell them, you don't have to cut them, but you can pop the tag off a certain type of way. I'm going to have to Google it. I'm in this group on Facebook called Telfar Talk. And y'all, they really be going in a frenzy about this bag. So I was picking this bag random, but I'm just so happy that I picked it because it's like slim pickings. By the time this video is uploaded, the uh, bag security program that launched in April, it'll be over by then. But yes, when they have another bag security program or when they drop this bag, y'all need to get this bag because it is so pretty. Even my mama, I had my mama unbox my bags for me just to be sure that everything was okay and I didn't have any issues. Um, child, she didn't want my bag. Oh, girl, you have to get y'all okay but no she was trying to get my bag y'all so yeah i like that bag next up we have the small navy which same packaging it has the same so far established 2005 new york city it comes with the details on the bag which i like that that he adds details so that way you can make sure that you're getting the right bag like come on now i like that support a black owned business period comes in the same cute little duster and it's so cute y'all I, I like the fact that the dusters aren't all just one size that they're they basically fit the size of your bag because I don't like all those big duster bulky bags especially if it's not a big bag so this is the navy which I think is cute I feel like I should have got a medium in this but I like it um it's very cute it's very pretty it's different y'all know me I like dark colors and look and see how vibrant, like, how navy blue the blue is, like, it's so pretty. It also comes with the tag as well, like the Azalea did. And then you can also pop this one off a particular way, just in case you ever want to resell your Telfar bags. Very cute. This one also comes with the button on the inside, just in case you want to pop your bag closed. This one doesn't come with a zipper on the inside. I believe that the medium and the large come with a zipper on the inside just in case you need to put any additional items in your purse. I'm happy that I didn't get any larges because those larges would have been too big. Like the medium is the perfect size. Like literally, this is the perfect size bag. Cause y'all know me, I don't like big bulky bags, but I feel like this is a perfect bag, especially if I want to wear like a crossbody or if I want to wear like um, just a off the shoulder bag. So yeah. I'm really glad that I didn't get like a super duper big bag. Medium does come with a zipper on the inside. Just making sure that y'all can see that. It does come with a zipper on the inside, which is good because if you need any items that are in your bag and you need them to be secure, that's a good thing. I do like the fact that it comes with like a Velcro type of thingy <laughs> to secure your bag to make sure that it doesn't move. How I picked these two different colors colors don't go together or nothing but that's not what matters it's just about the bags you know and you're supporting a black owned business i love to support black owned businesses especially when they're very upfront and direct with what to expect especially buying from like a bag security program he did let me know in advance that i wouldn't receive my bags until march 30th but i actually received them early in that so you know it's all about being transparent and being very direct and forward i really appreciate that because a lot of brands don't do things like that two bags all in all, I will rate my experience a 10 out of 10. He let me know when I was going to get my bags. I got them earlier than that. They made sure to contact you each and every step of the way, which I appreciate. I like to know 
when my package is. Normally, I'm the type of person like, okay, I bought something, I need a tracking number right now. <laughs> but I mean, I knew what I was getting myself into. Like the fact that they notify you each step of the way on where your bags are located, I really appreciate that. The quality is very good. I know that a lot of people complain about the bags ripping and stuff, but honestly, me, speaking for myself, I don't plan to have these bags as an everyday bag. This is more like an outfit type basis bag, I guess you could say. And also, I don't like to put a lot of stuff in my purse. I'm the type of person like, if my purse gets too junky, I'm gonna clean my bag out right away. That's just how I am. So I don't plan on using these bags on an everyday basis, but you know, I am going to wear the bags. So I will just say that they did have a bag security program pass by. It started on the 14th, I believe. Yeah, it started on the 14th and it ends today, which is the 18th when I'm recording this. It ends at 11.59 p.m. Um, so I did order some more bags. And y'all like, girl, you ain't even wore these bags. Girl, I know, but mm -mm. you gotta get those bags when they had a bag security program because I'm just not the type of person to be hoping and wishing like, oh, I'll get the bag, you know, whenever they let it out. Mm -hmm. No, I'm not doing it. I would just rather do the bag security program and make sure that I'm gonna get my bags. Like even if I have to wait, um, I believe it's between July and October when you're supposed to receive your bags. So hopefully I, I receive those early July. Four more colors on the way. I ordered two more mediums and two smalls. Um, so I'll be sure to do an unboxing video on that just in case y'all want the tea on that whenever I receive those. But yes, girl, that is the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.